learning today we will be discussing a very important topic that is from sap s4 hana and it is about fico system and in this system we will be discussing the cost center and profit centers concept in fico s4 hana so profit center accounting or pca in sap is a sub module of sap co that enables organizations to track and analyze the financial performance of different profit centers within an organization pca profit center accounting allows companies to divide their organizational structure into distinct profit centers profit center accounting is closely integrated with other sap modules such as figl co cost center accounting and co internal orders so this is the standard hierarchy of profit cent center we have different profit center groups profit center group 1 2 3 and under each group we have different segment level segment 1 segment 2 and we have further hierarchies uh, in this accordingly in order to create profit centers for company code we need to activate profit center indicators for the fiscal year in uh, controlling areas how to activate profit center accounting in sap to activate profit center accounting in sap we can just use t code oke5 or we can follow this path that is visible on your screen starting from spro then img from img we have to select controlling then profit center accounting then basic setting controlling area settings maintain control area settings so in this way the profit centers are activated in sap this is the uh, window that you will see when we will be Uh, turning on the profit center accounting in which we have control area settings the standard hierarchy the profit center local currency if it's dollars or euros or indian currencies indian rupees etc and then we have to uh, select the year from control indicator and active indicator should be marked tick okay this is the third step and we we have to save this window in standard hierarchy you maintain the settings for for a controlling area you must enter the name of standard hierarchy for the profit centers assigned to that controlling area so similarly in profit center local hierarchies you can define one extra currency for each controlling area in the transaction data the system updates this currency and the transaction currency and local currency the active indicator check tick mark is activated is marked to activate the profit center accounting for your controlling of that specific fiscal year so this is the loop we have profitability segment then sales order asset maintenance order materials production order process orders internal order for projects cost objects and cost centers and we have profit center in the middle so you can see the path to configure profit center accounting we can utilize the features of profit center accounting from sap easy access screen and also from img screen for easy access you can see from profit center uh, we have to come at standard hierarchy and here we have profit center groups in img screen we have uh, this for img screen you can see we have to select the profit center then we have uh, the multiple transactions like define standard hierarchy define profit center define profit center groups etc so in this way we can use both of these the easy access or display img screens to the, get these transactions profit center standard hierarchy the profit center standard hierarchy is a tree structure which displays the organization of all the profit centers in one controlling area the structure elements in the standard hierarchy are the profit center area and the summarization area uh, let's discuss the steps to create profit center standard hierarchy 
the step first step is you enter your controlling area and the profit center groups controlling area is entered and profit center group is entered after that we have to right click on profit center group and select create profit center or create group in this way you can see in the below screen that these steps are done and picture is taken that uh, we have to select the create profit center and then we have to select the create group option any one of these we have to select one of these we have to click save the third step is enter entering the basic details related to profit center like name the person responsible segment analysis period etc so these are the details that we have to enter in the, uh, in, the in the third step so after that you will see the, uh, the a standard hierarchy of profit center will be created the screen is visible in front of you and uh, after this when this screen is available and you have entered all the relevant details then you have to click save profit center group it is 4 to 10 digits alphanumeric code in SAP through T code KCH1 a profit center group is a grouping or categorization used to organize and manage profit centers within an organization profit center groups provide a higher level of management controls enabling managers to assess the performance of large segments of the organization profit center groups can be used for budgeting and planning purposes the steps to create the profit center groups again we have to enter the controlling area and the name of a profit center group you can see below here after that we can create profit center and profit center group directly in this standard hierarchy method you can see we have the same level or the lower level for same level you have to enter details accordingly and to lower level you have to click it and the details will be entered in the lower level of hierarchy a profit center is a key organizational unit for internal management accounting and reporting purposes the profit centers can represent various business units departments, product lines, geographic regions or any other relevant stand segments of company. Profit centers help establish fair transfer prices for goods and services exchanged between different segments of organization. Profit centers are essential for budgeting and planning processes, assist in setting financial targets and expectations of each unit. Let's again discuss the steps to create profit centers. We have to enter controlling area and the profit center enter the fields like name person responsible profit center group segment then first save as in inactive and then select activate when first you have to save it as inactive and then you have to open it again and then you have to activate this profit center select company how to activate the inactive profit center we have to select company code then tick checkbox uh, checkbox is to be done in the assigned section and then we have to save then that profit center will be activated you can see the checkbox of inactive profit center to activate and click the tick button and then through this way the above profit center is activated it is recommended that not to delete any profit center deleting a profit center could have cascading effects it is generally better to inactive or achieve profit centers rather than deleting them so in this video we have discussed in detail how to activate the profit centers how to create new profit centers how to create profit center groups how to <coughs> sorry to enter different details in profit centers and profit center groups how to create hierarchies at same level and different levels so i hope this session will be very beneficial and it will be very helpful for all of you if you are working in financial acumen of any organization in your organization specifically and for any question you can just write in comments tab and please like and share this video uh, for any question just write in comments tab until next time take care bye bye